Hey guys, welcome back. Today we'll be doing a third unboxing. So this is our box number three from our case of Phyrexia All Will Be One. So again, just as a normal disclaimer, um, Phyrexia All Will Be One's release date is um, the 10th of February. We are LGS. We did not buy this from anywhere else. We are opening this up only for our singles in time for our pre-order. Pre-release is on the 3rd of February. So if you enjoy the set, remember, support your local game store play over there and um, yeah we'll be doing unboxing and basically just to see how the distribution is because there's so many different variants of what um, packs um, cards are so it's actually very very difficult to keep up with everything in my opinion so I'm gonna open and have a look and we'll see how we go um, our boxes are actually made in Japan um, so the foil is a lot more subtle than it should be and um, so I'm not too sure how the English version will be. It might actually look very, very nice. I really don't know at this stage. And uh, because we can't actually have access to um, US print cards. So it's a bit of a bummer. So, all right. So each box, there are actually 12 booster packs, as you can see there. And each pack, there is 15 cards. So we'll go with that. And just so you know, because this is actually a JP print, um, the rears and the foils, oh, the, the foil rears and all that is actually in the front. All right, so we'll, we'll start from there. So pack number one, we have Phyrexia Might. And this is our first um, extended foil. We have a borderless Dark Six Shores, non-foil. And we have a step to complete. Um, basically, I call it the showcase one, but it's actually like the oil slick cards. Then we have a normal one and non foil. Then our commander card, Full Mirrodin. I don't know what Full Mirrodin does, so <laughs> don't ask. And we have a normal one. And then we have our four up land. Un two uncommons and four commons. Phyrexia Might Monument We have Kemba, so this is the uh, What If card Cranker Bloom So what if um, planks, uh, the, What if the good guys turn bad guys But technically they actually give you Like all the bad guys actually do Have a version like that anyway Well, at least for the 5 Planeswalkers Which I don't think we've pulled yet So and normal foil, and we have a Phyrexian, um, Phyrexian Island, two uncommons, and four commons. All I can say is that the good part about having a JP print is that the card quality is actually a lot better. I remember in the last few sets uh, I've been complaining oh foil oh, not not a foil but a mythic one um, what I've been complaining is that the the card art the, the, the cards have been coming out like damage and stuff like that um, there is one issue that I've noticed with the step to complete I'm not too sure if you can see it I'm going to try and um, I'm going to try and focus it on but no, probably not. With the naked eye, there is actually one cut line from here to there. And I think it's actually the gloss breakage. But I can't really I can't really show on here, but I can actually see it myself. It's a bit strange how I can't actually catch it on the camera. But um when you open packs you'll notice that um mm, yeah, this one has one down here. This one has one up. It feels like the old, um, you know, maybe it's actually not one whole row or something. I'm actually not too sure how that is, but that's what I've actually been noticing. So I'm not, again, not too sure how the US print um, of the collector boosters will be, but this is what I've been seeing in the Japanese prints. All right, so we have that. So for box number four, because the store is actually getting a bit more busier now, so I probably will be doing the last three boxes in a later time, probably later tonight or something like that. So we'll have a look. Two, three, oh, one, two, and two, three, four. Yeah. 
Phyrexia might. Ooh, Kimba. So this is actually the foil version. So again, you can see that, sure, you can actually see the foiling is there, but uh, I'm actually quite I'm actually quite excited to see American print ones. Senior Dancer. Yeah, there is actually another line over there as well. So. For the green Silex. Friction Land. One, two, one, two, three, four. Rebel, Milera, that art actually looks pretty freaky, but um, yeah, so there's a what if manga foil, and then we have a Borderless, Frex and Vindicator, oh that looks really cool, so it's actually a mythic um, step to complete, so that's actually really nice. So one, one other thing I have with this one is that it seems very washed out, you can't really, I'm again, not too sure if it's the JP print or something like that. It doesn't look that nice. Like, yeah, it's it's just a very washed out color on the non foil ones. The foil ones is actually not as bad. Like, um, but then it actually applies to the manga ones as well. The what if cards, which I'm not a fan of. So it feels that uh, it's kind of making you really want to get the foil or the stick to complete versions if you really want it to look nice. Yeah. Oh, cool. So, in Kari Dominus. So, this is a foil mythic um, borderless, the one that double proliferates. And we got Tivel. Uh, sorry, Tiva. And we got Nikon Rock Priest. So, it's a bit of a bummer that there is no. And then. One. And then Blue Sun's Twilight. Forest. Minor the Misty. And one, two, three, four. Alright, next pack. Alright, so we have Rebel, Token, Green Sun's Twilight, so bad, Solo Bad, Ooh, Rear Ava. Oh, that actually looks really cool. I remember in box number two, we opened the, um, the non, the normal version, and that looks so much more darker. That contrast looks really, really good. And this one, ah, there's one line there. <laughs> it feels like it's actually like a fold line so for production and stuff. So it's going to bug a lot of people off, but it's not really there unless you really look for it there. One, two, three. So five more packs left. Rebel, Urbrusk, Forge. We have Koth, what if? Non foil and Soul Swamp Scam. That's a step to freaks, uh, step to completion. And Commander, we have All Will Be One. That's a mythic. So it's like an infinite combo with Commander with one of the 40k cards, I believe. And then one, two, one, two, three, four. Yeah, yeah, so always like a leaf. Okay, uh, Oops, pop up there. Rebel. We have Varan, so there's actually just a non foil, there's just a foil one. I don't think we have the. Yeah, okay. Varan, foil. Uh, oh, Galissa, that art actually looks a lot better than the normal one that they've spoiled. Not a fan of that one. Saint Cranker, Drumling, Sequel, Normal Sequel, um, Swamp, and then 1, 2, 1, 2, 3, Alright, we have Phyrexia Might again. <laughs> and we have, oh, the new Birthing Pod, but for blue instead. <laughs> I think that was actually just like spoiled, but and it's only for Commander. Right. We have the Red King, but unfortunately we don't have Step 2, Step Up, and we have a Common again. Oh, so sad. And then Normal Foil and a Non Foil. And then we have our Extended. And then that 
yeah. and then we have Kaya. Uh, Swamp. Yeah. One, two. One, two, three, four. All right, lucky last two pack. So we have Rebel, Foil Dark Six Shores. So it's actually quite interesting because the expeditions of these ones will probably be a bit more sought after from Zendika Rising. Kaito, Furnace, Senior Dancer, Last Mine. And we have one Mirror and Safe House, Green Sun Twilight. And then one, two, one, two, three, four. And lucky last, this one seems a bit, a bit underwhelming, I think. Um, pack number three, box number three actually feels a lot underwhelming than the first two boxes. Evolve um, Spindrum for XMPs. That art actually looks really cool. Oh, Boring Clicks. Oh, interesting. So we actually did get one. So LS Snow, I think we got Foil. Then I think Ourobras, we got like Step to Complete. And this one we have Normal non foil and ah uh, bird oops ah we got Jace the perfect mind foil but not a Phyrexian language bit of a bummer because I personally quite um, collect I could personally collect the Phyrexian language cards so one two Alright, so this this time, this box seems a bit underwhelming, there's no like super heavy hitters and stuff like that, but it's actually pretty cool. So that's box number 3, and yeah, we'll continue with box number 4 a bit later on. Thanks for watching, take it easy.